camping has changed over the years. I realize I'm at kind of a luxury campground compared to tent camping in the wilderness, but those guys put their own computer in a game of Fortnite. That is camping I never would have thought would have happened. We are here at Smoke's Poutinery. It's time to jump on that Canadian delicacy, the poutine train. Smoke's Poutinery. When they make the word, just to name the place, you know it's gotta be good. Poutine, which if you don't know, is french fries, gravy, and cheese curds. It's super good, but I think I've ordered too large of a meal. Well, I didn't think I would be able to finish it, but I did, even though there was a ton of it. So needless to say, I probably won't be having breakfast tomorrow. Geeking out right now in the local comic store. One, because it's comics, and two, because their air conditioning is so nice. It is finally starting to cool down here in downtown Vancouver. It's actually nice to walk around now, but my stomach is gurgling and full of poutine that I just ate. Alright, there goes the train and I am back one bus ride away from the campground. I got back to the bus station and it was an hour till my bus so I just went in and got all the tea from this place. It was super good. I drank it really quick because it was just that good. It looked like this one. Normally, a bubble tea place tries to go skimpy on the tapioca beads or pearls or whatever they are, but this place, full on, they were generous in their amount, and I couldn't have had a better bubble tea worth every penny. It was said by the men who lived there.